the voice of the voiceless has returned. CM Punk has done it all at WrestleMania. Won Money in the Bank, defended the WWE title, faced The Undertaker. But CM Punk wants one more bullet point on his WrestleMania resume. Compete in the main event and win. I gotta tell you, it still feels so surreal to see CM Punk back in a WWE ring. Never say never in WWE. And CM Punk is ready to prove himself all over again. The Scottish Warrior has arrived. A multi-time world champion and a Royal Rumble winner. And to this day, one of the toughest fighters in WWE. Forget that incredible moment for Drew McIntyre when he won the WWE Championship in the main event of WrestleMania 36. Something tells me the countdown to Claymore has already begun. The Scottish Warrior prepared for battle. And a last man standing match is fairly unique in our business. You cannot win unless your opponent fails to meet the count of 10. And what you failed to mention is you can do anything you want in order to stop that from happening. Someone check the back for any tractor trailers. The Kimura, the Kimura. Kimura lock cinched in. And look at this, Kimura lock. Nowhere to go but for him. Oh my God, they broke out of it. Load over neck breaker. Picture perfect. Oh, that's a chop you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Oh! He's returning fire. A stalemate of counters. Especially in the early goings of a last man standing. The best thing a superstar can do when they're not the one being counted out is to get their bearings. Make sure you're breathing right. Worry about exerting yourself if and when your opponent starts getting up. Yeah, little things like that can be the difference maker in a lengthy match. He knew that was coming. Play to my left hand. Drew fending him off. Look at this. Oh, and a bad breaker. Right to the spine. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Bringing a steel chair into play here. And we just saw some serious offense. The Scottish Warrior on the warpath. Beats the 10 count. Going to put 
Goes on through the match. And this match will head back to the ring. Big time height on that kick. And McIntyre's need to fight being met in kind there. A kick right to the back of the leg. Here we go. It's popping off. Ooh. Just teeing off with that fight forever vibe. Back and forth. Neither one giving up any ground. Both absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. And Punk gets countered there. McIntyre reverses and looks to capitalize. Worldline hits its mark. Dodges the attack. Shots out quick. Claymore. That might be all Drew needs. Drew flexing his muscle as he attempts to rally the troops. Count still climbing. We're up to seven now. Lifts him up down. Like being manhandled by a bear. Things now not going well for CM Punk. It's got to be hard to be CM Punk right now. Kick to the gut. On top. Future shot. Good night. McIntyre might have him. McIntyre is so burning right now. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Knock out victory. This one is over. Here is your winner. The Scottish Warrior. A bitter loss in this one for CM Punk. The Scottish Warrior is so versatile, and it came into play tonight. He's back! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Punk! Punk's first tour of duty in WWE was epic. The pipe bomb set off an entirely new era in WWE. But oh, how times have changed since then. Yeah, when you think about the past accomplishments, Corey, CM Punk has been a WWE champion. He won Money in the Bank. So many other titles. But this current version of CM Punk is driven to surpass those past achievements. WWE is a different world than when Punk left a decade ago. This company's evolved. Now he must evolve. Punk better evolve, Punk better raise his game, because nowadays there are many who claim to be the best in the world.
WWE Universe, we are about to see what's best for business. The game is taking business into his own hands here tonight. From British Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, Triple H. Over the last decade, we have seen this man's dominance grow. From a blue blood to a degenerate to a multiple-time WWE champion. Indeed, Triple H has solidified himself at the top of the food chain in WWE, and he has no plans on stepping down anytime soon. And I don't think anyone can take him down. The creator of the pedigree, a truly devastating move. Yeah, and he's mastered how, when, and where to utilize it. Yeah, the pedigree almost always guarantees the end for Triple H's opponent. I guarantee Triple H already has plans on when to use it tonight. And in the ring is Triple H, the so-called King of Kings. He spent his entire career asserting his dominance here in WWE, forcing others to submit to his authority. As far as he's concerned, all must bow before the King. Triple H has an almost fanatical desire to accumulate power and enforce his will with an iron fist and, often, a sledgehammer. Yeah, when it comes to protecting his throne, the King of Kings will use any and every weapon at his disposal. Yeah, but across the ring from him is the... From way up, the double axe handle. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. Being carried around with ease. Right across the larynx. And a series of vicious stomps. You can feel the resentment building with each stomp there. Placed into the corner. In the corner. And an elbow for good measure. Intensity just pouring out of the game. Bump needs to reformulate a strategy. Good defense. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Triple H is always thinking out there, always a couple steps ahead of his opponents. I can't imagine a world in which that's not the case here tonight. I expect we'll see the very best of the Cerebral Assassin here tonight, Corey. From behind, back suplex. Walking in the sleeper hold, and into a neck breaker. Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it. I'm out of here. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. He eludes the contact. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? He steps foot in the ring again. Beautiful. Breaker. Picture perfect. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. Is it enough? He's able to kick out before two. It'll take more than that to hold him down. Plants him with a Uranagi. Seamless transition into the Anaconda Vice. I'm not quite sure if this. A uh, couple of knees there. That'll get him out of it. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. The cross-face chicken win. 
And delivers it. Oh, right there. Elbow. And gets out of it. Uh-oh. Turns that back on. The game with the double underhook. Here we go. Wow. Triple H got it. Drop. Piercing. Uh-oh. High risk. Cross body. No sign of hesitation. And that risk gained big rewards. And an elbow. <laughs> Triple H with a counter. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Countered it just in time. Uh-oh. And he's able to reverse. Uh-oh, sweet dreams coming. Got to sleep. That just waylaid the game. And he gets set back into the ring. What are you waiting for? Get back in there. You tell him, Saxton. Cover! Digging deep for the kick out. Somehow, someway, he is still in this. Now, really drop kick. The game's starting to look beaten here. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. A torturous knee. The game in bad shape right now. CM Punk is stifling the opposition now. Uh-oh, uh -oh. Punk never saw that coming. Triple H reversing the momentum on him. Triple H showing it's not a time for lying down. It's a time for fighting back. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. Wasting no motion on the counter. Enable the count. Here we go. Time to work out some aggression. He turns it around. Now it looks like Triple H is bleeding after that exchange. Slugging away with everything they've got. Now is not an option. They have to finish this. Oh my goodness. What a double-handed shot. He's been placed in the corner now. Oof. Back elbow puts a stop to things. Counter upon counter, great minds thinking alike. Drop kick! Great athleticism. And Punk gets countered there. still has some fight left. Punk is shaky. The end of the track for him could be near. Triple H hooks the arms. This is vintage Hunter right here. Pedigree. Triple H has this all sewn up. The cover. Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. You can't forget how defiant Punk is. You might throw your best at him, but he'll still keep getting up. Triple H remains composed. Punk looking for GTS. The to sleep. GTS from Punk. The game down might be in for Triple H. And that'll finally do it. What a victory. Here is your winner. CM Punk standing tall in victory here. Yeah, this has to be reaffirming for CM Punk and all of his convictions.